Is this thing on? Hey guys, it's Aaron and Vera and we are really happy to finally show you our apartment so we're going to do a quick apartment tour and show you the place that we managed to find yes. so so far we have been here for three weeks we're extremely happy with the apartment and for your information we're paying uh, 550 dollars per month which is pretty reasonable considering how close we are to aaron's work yeah bear in mind that we are in district 7 so it's a little bit more pricey than other areas but for this price, compared to some of the other apartments that we saw, we got a really good deal. Okay, so let's go check it out. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna show you our kitchen. So we have a pretty spacious kitchen, as you can see, there's loads of space to prepare stuff and blah 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 uh, we have a standard gas cooker so if you have a look in here we don't pay gas bill we just basically buy one of these things every few months i think they last us for like two or three months we don't actually cook that often so hopefully we'll have to replace that for a while and uh yeah that's pretty much our kitchen i mean we got this microwave with the apartment and um, fridge too which it's looking pretty empty, but mm -hmm. we've been pretty... We get a lot of takeaway pretty much because it's so cheap here. Yeah. So my favorite thing about this kitchen though is that when I'm doing the dishes, which I hate, we have this pretty amazing view outside. Check it out. Okay, so that's the kitchen. And then over here we have the dining table area. So. We have most of our dinners here. Again, look at the cool view outside. And I also spend most of my time here doing my lesson planning and preparing for work and stuff like that. So yeah. So this is our amazing living room area. We have this comfy couch that came with the apartment. It has lots of pillows, as you can see. And over here, we have a little entertainment section with uh, the TV. A little portable gaming collection. <sighs> okay. And if you look outside this window, it's pretty cool that we have all these dragonflies flying around pretty much every day. So this is our spare bedroom, which will be hopefully in the future used as a guest room. It's pretty plain right now and we just use it for a laundry and kind of storage. So here is our little balcony area, which is just mainly used for uh, washing up. And as you can see, it's pretty rainy right now. So this is our little foyer area. So as you can see our front door and we have a little shoe cabinet which is very handy and here is our bathroom it's probably the least exciting room in the house and it's a bit plain but it's functional we really wanted to find a place that had a bathtub yeah but it's like that there we had we saw a few places that had buff, uh, bathtubs but the actual bedrooms were really horrible in them um, yeah i mean you know it works the shower is really hot when it needs to be and cold when it needs to be and it's clean enough so you know we're we're okay with this oh and this thing for those oh, of you yeah. for those of you who live in europe you are missing out yeah, I can't believe that. the bomb gun is the greatest invention of all time we are we are the bomb gun so next up we're gonna show you our upstairs because we have the top floor so we can have a So we have like a penthouse apartment which means we basically have two floors which is really cool So let's take you upstairs So this is our bedroom Originally there was nothing here but we moved the bed because of the aircon, as it's the nicest one in the house, so it makes it really nice to sleep down here. So, yeah. And down here we have a little 
extra storage area with some shelves and there is a light here two lights so, so, so far we haven't found a use for this place but apart from storing our suitcases long story short we have loads of space that we don't know what to do with yes <laughs> <laughs> and uh yeah i mean originally the bedroom this bedroom this bed was in that room but because there's just like so much nice like so nice and like spacious here. spacious here we just thought we'd move it here so i don't know what you guys think but we think it looks pretty nice here. yeah it's pretty good and yeah, we've got a nice view of downstairs too so this used to be the original bedroom and it has a Closet because now we can actually have one, and here I'm gonna see closed. Yeah, so oh shit. <laughs> so the bed that we just showed you used to be in here, but it gets pretty hot in here, and also there's this like slanted roof, so it yeah, feels a bit like it's very like cramped in here, and you can pretty much put your hand over here. Yeah, so I mean, if we have guests around, they can just sleep on the bed oh sleep on the bed like inflatable beds get inflatable beds in here or something i don't know but as you can see we've got a lot of unused space Pow! okay guys so now i'm gonna take you outside and show you around our building Okay guys, so we hope you enjoyed our apartment tour. If you have any questions that you feel like asking, drop them down in the comment section below. Um, again, we are paying 550 US dollars a month. So between the two of us, that's really cheap. Our bills are like, I don't know. They're about 2 million BND a month, so it's not too bad. Yeah, so the last batch of bills we paid, which included uh, water, gas, sorry, water, no gas. electricity, internet and the management fee and the building management fee it was like 40 quid altogether so you know still pretty good okay guys thank you for watching make sure you like the video and subscribe to us if you haven't done so already we also have a facebook page instagram and twitter if you would like to check those out also don't forget to check out our website aaronandvera.com and until the next video we will see you again okay here's a view from the balcony at night uh, I think you'll agree that it's not too bad of a view. Alright guys, we'll catch you later. Peace!